Hi, I'm eating quinoa and like cabbage or like like broccoli, like snap peas, like okay. And I thought this would be a good time to start my next video. I'm currently editing the hair dye video. I just posted the 4th of July one. Not that anyone would think this, but I just want to start off by saying this isn't tied to any company whatsoever. It's just my opinion, my thoughts, my story, our deal. So yes, this is all what it's like performing in an acapella competition. I guess first you have to have your group. During the normal school year, I compete with my collegiate acapella group, the Chaptones. My fam, but I've just joined another group called Aperture, which is made up of all students that do acapella at Chapman, but now we like formed our own like smaller group. It's seven of us. I sing tenor, which if you don't know is the highest male part. And like Avery arranges so high. For me, I'm always like, I was just practicing. It's like, It's like always up there. And then sometimes I get to sing down here. Sometimes. But yeah, so we've been in rehearsal for a couple months, but we have not yet. Okay, so the it's Saturday. The competition is one week away. We have not had a rehearsal with all seven of us yet. <laughs> Only six people, but it's been like alternating which six, so it's Save the turtles. Finn, noggin, dude. At most competitions, the judges will score you based on vocals, of course, and a whole bunch of different categories like intonation, pitch, rhythmic accuracy, different things like that. And then there's also a visual presentation section that could be choreo or just like how you present yourself if it's professional, things like that. So yeah, I'm gonna take you into one of our rehearsals. We're finishing up music and then this week will be a lot of movement and then I'll take you to the show on Saturday and it's gonna be a great time. Okay, bye. Jacket. Will you please model it for me? Can I just give me a second, everyone? <laughs> I just think also with this outfit could be just like a safe look. I mean, plastic's in because it's all about being transparent. People like know you're coming because they can <laughs> hear you. Oh yeah. <laughs> so today was supposed to be outfit check, but everyone forgot. <laughs> I didn't forget. I sent mine to Steven before. So I'm going for this shirt, which I got on clearance at Urban Outfitters. These pants, which I got Forever 21, they're like flowy. This jacket, which I got from Zara, also on sale. So I just got this in the mail right now from Fashion Nova. Yes. Yeah, that looks good. But uh, it's very tight and I literally cannot <laughs> and we kind of have similar pants going on. Like. A little bit of a similar thing going on. Yeah. Woo! So today we're like, literally have a four hour rehearsal oh, yeah, so we can true. just like hammer out choreo yeah. and get it all done by the end of today. Because the show is in five days. <laughs> I want to talk about what I did today. Oh my god! <laughs> so Avery and I went to like the office of the music building. At the front desk they had like these little candies that were like espresso flavored candies. And I took one and oh. I ate it and it was so good. And then I made Avery go back with me just so I could get like four more. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm drawing a flower. A crimson Wait. flower. I'm trying to make it very renaissance to like have this like brushy feel. Graphic you know? design is my passion. Avo. Uh, so I've kind of already told them about like like the basics of what we're doing and everything. Okay. Will you talk about how kind of like we had to do music and now we have to do visual? Of course, so the score sheet is set up so about 60% of the score, no, 66% of the score is musical and then 30% of the score is visual. So we do like actually have to have something visually going on, even though like it's a pro competition, not a collegiate competition. So like visual is like- Secondary. Secondary. <laughs> Secondary is a good word. So our system is the choreo being pre-made and pre-mapped. Guys, Crisis. I'm gonna give Strong. you an update. Um, oh, okay. So basically Amazing. I just tried yeah, this mint everything. chocolate chip gum for the first We're time good. and I actually love it. It tastes mint? so good. Yeah. yeah, it's so good. Go buy this. This is mint chocolate chip gum mukbang. Like if you don't have it, <laughs> That's my new single. I have no water. I have, okay, I have a 40 ounce water bottle. Good vibes. And I'm always out of water. I don't, my skin kind of looks nice. So tonight is our last rehearsal, Aperture's last rehearsal. It's Thursday before the competition on Saturday. 
in Los Angeles. We usually like to take Friday off so we can just like rest our voices, drink hot tea, do a neti pot, get in the brain space. My parents are coming, so we're probably just gonna go to the beach and I'll just chill and like apply sunscreen every two seconds. So yeah, the final rehearsal is just about running it as many times as we can, making sure we're super confident and just feeling good about it. And then it's almost showtime. I'm in a restaurant, but um, I just gotta make sure that when you have a show coming up that you're really like stretched out. What are we doing? We are singing. No, right now. We're <laughs> getting brunch yeah. because brunch. I am not a, I would not be a good vlogger. What are we doing? Would be great we are currently <laughs> at Jinky's Cafe. Yeah, in, oh, what's our, are we in Agora? Agora. Are we, we are in Agora Hills, California. <laughs> I am Ian, the beatboxer for Aperture. So basically we're in my hometown um, <laughs> and we are about to compete at the IC uh, a -O -A. A -O -A. O -A. We just love performing so we're here. Right. <laughs> Do I need to look yes. at the camera or look at you? Look at oh. me or okay. do whatever you want. Guys Let's... tell me in the comment section what you like about What's really? the most special oh. thing about this like area where you grew up? I love it because it's like, you know what it's, like um, it's like those, uh, I don't know how to describe it in English. Stay in Farsi. <laughs> yeah, Jay has to show us how that. So basically I just said it has a bunch of old people but also people are really nice. So we're at the theater. We just warmed up. The theater is gorgeous. Oh, 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 oh. But basically now we go into this meeting where we get to hear like the rules. They talk to us about like mic checks and then we do the worst part of any competition is drawing the show order to make it the most fair and just random as possible. We literally just draw numbers out of a hat. Hi Steven. Okay, we're going, we're going. Bye, 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 bye. My hands were like sweating, it was gross, and I was like, I felt bad for Ian because he was holding my hand, and I feel like it was just like a river in there. We're going third. We're going third. We're going third out of seven. How do you so feel about that? It's not perfect, but it's not as bad as it could be, so I'm feeling good. Yeah, I love it. Yeah, I'm good I, with I it. Too. I'm good with it. I say now would be a time to like get water or something, have a little bit of a sit down, and then come back at like. Mic check. Mic check. I need more than that. Showtime's in about three minutes, but we're not on until like, what, 7.30? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm really excited. We just had like a little debrief, so we're like really into show mode. But honestly, I'm just, thank you, thank you. Mm -hmm. But honestly, I'm Cute. just really excited for, we're gonna kill it on that stage, because we're just gonna have so much fun. No yeah. matter what happens, we're just gonna have so much fun. Yes. Yeah. So, we're in our outfits, and show is in uh, a minute ago. I have to pee, because I have to pee a million times. Like, I don't know if it's nervous peeing, or just like, I drank a lot of water today, probably a mixture of both, but, Gonna go pee now, okay, bye, love you.
performed and it was so 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 fun. Oh my gosh, I'm so And oh <laughs> and all the groups are literally amazing and like giving it their all and you can just tell like how much work people put into it and it's so cool to see so yeah so basically now the judges are deliberating so we're just waiting here we're chilling riffing and hi <laughs> yeah this weird thing happens where like on stage I have a like, clear voice and everything's good and then all of a sudden as soon as I get off I'm like uh, like dry like do you want cough drops? Guys, I have cough I drops. Yes, I'd actually love one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hannah, the cough drop queen. Oh, 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 oh. I love this song. We get it, you sing. I'm feeding you. Mm, like, like a mama bird. <laughs> Hi, Stephen Lee has entered the group chat. <laughs> Sting bing. Sting bing. Someone explain Sting Bing. I feel like we need Ian. It's oh, Ian. Ian. I just started saying Stephen really, really weird. And it was like, Stephen. And then I was like, Stephen. And I was like, Stephen. And then it just got weirder and weirder and weirder until I was like, Sting Bing. Uh, and thus it became Sting Bing. If you want to say it like more authentically, you got to add some like Sting Bing. You know? <laughs> sting Bing. Oh, we have to do it faster. One, two, three, four. Oh. Right. One, two, three, four. Oh. The Aka Open West semifinal champion. And let it take over.